It's a crime that rocked Siena, uh, Sienega High School. A former assistant basketball coach pleaded guilty Friday to attempted sexual conduct with a student. He was also uh, a security staff member. Nine on your sides, Veronica Veraccio talked with the principal about a concern many parents have, the vetting process for their staff. Just over one year ago, Seneca High School's former assistant basketball coach Seneca Turner was arrested for alleged sexual misconduct with a minor. According to the Pima County Sheriff's Department, the 37-year-old had been sending explicit messages to a 17-year-old girl at the school. Principal Niemer Hassey says the school has since provided more training to its staff and has been as thorough as they've ever been. We have uh, policies, board policy, Sienega policy, human resource to policy, and we present those policies and rules and regulations to every staff member uh, through professional development, through pre-service training, which before school even starts. All staff are pre-screened. Every single staff member is fingerprinted, has a thorough background check, and the criminal history is checked. Principal Hawsey reiterates the importance of protecting students. Student safety is a priority, and when things happen, uh, with any staff member, we are going to investigate it thoroughly and we're going to hold people accountable. Veronica Fernaccio, KGUN 9, on your side.